Welcome back to Garage 419. It's Sunday. We're here at Pebble Beach on the 18th fairway for the main event, the Concorde Elegance. Now, there are more cars here than I possibly know what to do with, uh, but we're going to show them to you. And we're going to even talk to some of the people who make those cars, and they're going to tell you a little more than you ever wanted to know. Why haven't you upgraded to Vista yet? Just the bad things I've heard about it. Today, I'm going to show you Windows Mojave. Well, that looked pretty simple. I'm actually blown away. I'm thinking I'd like to have this. Actually, this is Vista. Really? Now, Lamborghini is the featured mark here at Pebble Beach, so we've got a lot of the prototypes from the company's history. I'm going to show you some. Right here, the 350 GT, the first production prototype they made. Walk with me here. And then, going right, skipping right over down along, we've got the Miura, 1967 Miura prototype car, production prototype. Moving right along, and you've got the Miura Roadster prototype, which I would say is the first supercar Roadster out there, and it's ridiculous looking with this, with this flake in the paint. Come on. And you get the 1971 Miura SV prototype. Always looks good in yellow, classic. The LP400 Countach, which really started off the, the wedge-shaped exotic cars. A P140 prototype, which was the, the project car for the Diablo, and there's a lot of Diablo styling cues in there. The Lamborghini Raptor prototype, bodied by Zagato, which is based on a Diablo chassis, but looks obviously very different. And the Gallardo uh, crazy-looking spider concept, which I really wish they made. Uh, and they didn't, and that's sad. But there you have some serious prototypes throughout Lamborghini's history. Firebird oh, this 2. This is the Firebird they promised us 50 years ago. And Look what the Firebird became. I want jet engines in my Firebird. Now here's something really interesting that I've never even seen before. This is the 1959 Corvette Scalietti Coupe. Now in the late 50s, Carroll Shelby and Jim Hall went to Scalietti to try and build a body to compete against the Ferraris in racing. This is what they came up with. But the project took so long that it never really got off the ground. Those guys got frustrated and then went to AC and bought their bodies, turned it into the Cobra, which the rest is history. Now this, I guess, could have been the Cobra, but never was, unfortunately. It's an amazing looking car, and a nice little piece of history. You're familiar with the death race. The drivers are convicts and the rules are simple. It's kill or be killed. I can see the appeal. Win and get your freedom. Let's play a little offense. <laughs> You're out in front. Who are you going to shoot at? Hold tight. I love this game. You can burn me, you can shoot me, but you can't kill me. With it all starts August 22nd. You guys thought Concorso was bad with Ferraris. Check this out. Ready? Veyron. Veyron. Nice shirt. Veyron. Veyron Targa. The Camry's around here.
Is it, I know you probably get asked all the time, but what is your favorite of all the Lamborghinis? I would say, you know, the Miura was my first car I took on the road, and uh, Miura, Miura definitely is a big part of my, of my heart, of my career, you know. Mm. This car is the one I drove first time when I was 22. So.